Hey guys, welcome back. It's Hercules again. So today we will be doing some gameplay with Nita. Playing a few different games, playing SMG and Brawl Ball. You guys, a lot of you said that your favorite brawler is Nita, so I'm like, oh, I might as well use her. And I had a lot of fun using her. I just love her attack and her super. But in the end, the gameplay is not very important because today I wanted to do a Q and A. I want you guys to get to know me a little bit more, so I'm just going to answer some generic questions. So if you like that idea, hit the like button, and let's try to get 10 likes. I've never gotten that high, so please like it. So let's go with the first one. Why do you do YouTube? Well, YouTube's always been something I liked. I, I've watched videos. I love seeing all the different Brawl Star stuff and I used to love watching Call of Duty videos when I used to play So it's just always been a like constant thing that I have been watching and I have ultimately like wanted to start my own YouTube channel But just really never had like the courage enough I wasn't confident in being able to do videos and edit and just be able to talk for eight nine minutes in a row so it's something I always wanted to do, but to now I'm doing it, and I'm having a blast doing it, and I'm glad that you guys are here watching. But I really have to say that I do it because I'm playing, and I think I'm entertaining, so it just made sense to me. So, next question. What do I do for fun? So I'm a soccer player. I pretty much just play soccer multiple times a week. I'm constantly thinking about it, watching. Something I love to do. So that's definitely something I love to do. Uh, I love hanging out with my dog and that's pretty much it. I go to school, but that's, I wouldn't say that's something I like to do, but I do it anyways. Okay, next question. Do you like, what's your favorite sweet? Oof, that's a tough one. I think my favorite sweet would have to be ice cream. Can't go wrong with some ice cream. Um, my favorite probably cookies and cream. It's nice. I, I like more vanilla based ice cream. So, can't go wrong with that. Okay, next question. What is your favorite sports team? Well, so I got a few. Um, for soccer, it's Chelsea. They play in London. Great team. They they won a championship last year. I've been watching since high school, so can't go wrong with them. Uh, favorite football team, the Packers. I love them. I've been watching since Brett Favre. Probably a lot of you don't even know who that is. Uh, and then for basketball, it's the Clippers. Go Blake Griffin. And hockey, it's obviously the Ducks. Can't go wrong with the Ducks. And baseball is the Dodgers. So, that's, those are my favorites. Leave a comment down on who your favorite sports team is, because I'm a very, very competitive person and would love to hear and talk crap on your team. So, let me know who you like. And, so next question is, what's your favorite subject in school? I feel like this is a really bad question, because I don't really like any of them, but I'm very good at math, so I'd have to say math is my favorite. But... Uh, unless you count PE, because then PE was always my favorite. Next question is, what is something that people do that annoys you? And I have two, two really big ones. First one, I don't like when people talk like they know something, even though they don't. Like, if they think that they know these facts and try to tell me something and I know it's wrong, that annoys me. And the next one is the my biggest pet peeve and... If any of you do it, I'm going to be very disappointed in you, and I don't know if we could be friends anymore. Just kidding. But the biggest thing is when people back into spots when it's super busy. That's so annoying. You're wasting everyone's time just because you don't know how to back out of a spot. I don't know what the... Like, I guess it's convenient, but it's inconvenient just to do it in the first place. It's not that hard to back out of a spot. And this goes very perfectly into our next question. What would be something, if I was a dictator, what would be the weird dictator thing I would do? And it's same thing like if I was a president. My first 
thing in office would be that if you see someone back into a spot, you are legally allowed to slash their tires. Just that simple. You, that person is causing a lot of problems just by backing into their spot, taking up time, and you don't look cool doing it either. So you get your tires slashed. And I'm also thinking about you were allowed to hit one window, but th- that's going to be on the fence. That was going to be a tough one to get across the boat. But yeah, that's just something I would do. I'm a little crazy about it. Uh, I've seen people do it, and I instantly they're instantly on my don't like list. So if you're driving, please do not back into a spot. It's not that hard to reverse out of the spot, it, but it is different. If you can pull all the way through a spot and you're facing forward, that's fine. But if there's no way you can pull through and you're facing forward, your tires will be slashed. Not for real, but if I was a crazy dictator in this made up land, your tires would be slashed. Yeah, it's just something about me that really, really gets on my nerve. Just like this game. I feel like I played amazing in this gameplay right here because I kept getting super after freaking super. But of course, my team fails. and, And I feel like that's one thing that Nita's not really a person that usually gets her super after super because people are usually able to kill the bear. But in this game, I was just freaking destroying it. But we lose, but still fun. Okay, next question is, what is the most amazing thing that happened to you last week? Well, I think it has to be the support from you guys. I'm over 20 follow- I mean, twenty subscribers now. Sorry, Instagram on the mind. 20 subscribers and... That's amazing to me because the thought of even having 20 people want to see my videos is pretty cool. So I'm excited to keep growing and it only happens if with people like you. So thank you guys for watching the videos and just supporting me along the way. So please keep it up. I appreciate everything you guys do. And if you need support, I'm, I'm there for you. I'll help you guys. And what would you rate 10 out of 10 on? So I would rate 10 out of 10 on all my videos, of course, because they're the best things on earth. Okay, maybe not really, but I I think I do pretty well. But what would I rate 10 out of 10? I think this California weather, not, not too shabby. It's nice and warm still. It still feels like summer, so... That's fun. It can't go wrong. It's not that we don't have to face snow or anything. So I would rate that 10 out of 10. Okay. So my next question is, what are some of your quirks? And I think my big one is the fact that I get distracted so easily that I lose focus within a matter of moments that if something's going on around me, I get completely distracted. So that's definitely something weird with me. Like when I record, I have to do it in a quiet area with no noise. When I'm doing homework, I need music, but at super low, because if it's too high, then I'm distracted. So that's just one thing about me. And my last question that I'm gonna get into for this video, if you have more, please leave some in the comment section, because I'd love to answer them sometimes so you guys get to know me a little bit better. <clears throat> so, the last one is what is the best way to spend your time and I think that's with friends or family spending it doing something you love I think with people that you love that's the best way to live life at all in general so if you're doing that then you're doing something right so I hope you guys can do that so that will be my I guess Q&A even though We really didn't get any questions from you guys, but like I said, leave a comment and I'll answer I'll get to those questions, guys. Well, I just want to thank you guys for watching again. Thank you guys for the 22 subscribers and just leaving all that love. I'll keep doing what I'm doing. Thank you guys.